Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Madeline Schmidt. A man who just cannot stay away from UNM's campus is in jail tonight. Police say he terrorized people on campus multiple times earlier this week. News 13's Jeannie Nguyen is here with what happened. Jeannie. Madeline, UNM police say Jose Baron tried to stab the manager of the sub after he was caught rifling through equipment used for the school's blood drive. UNM police say they got a call just before 1 a.m. on Thursday. The manager of the student union building noticed Baron going through equipment for a blood drive in a ballroom. When the the manager told Baron to leave. Police say he pulled a knife. The manager chased Baron outside where police say Baron lunged at him. The manager picked up a metal metal patio chair to defend himself, but when he put it back down, police say Baron picked it up and threw it at the manager, hitting him in the lower back. Baron got away, but police would end up getting another call about him on Thursday night, trying to rob someone on campus and arrested him. Today, students say this makes them worried about their safety at school. Most of the time, not everyone's paying attention to their surroundings because, you know, why would you have to be um, alert for those kind of kinds of things? And as it turns out, Baron is no stranger to UNM police. Back in July, he was caught on campus twice, once posing as a construction worker on campus, then also found going through students' lockers. Right now, Baron is sitting in jail waiting to see a district court judge who will decide if he should be held in jail without bond until trial. Madeline, back to you. All right, thank you, Jeannie. Now, tonight on News 13 at 10, we'll have more on Baron's history at UNM and surveillance video from this latest incident.